Starman Podcast. Hello and welcome to a Starman Talk the Talks. I am your host, Devin. With me is Billy and David. Woo! Greetings to everyone. And guys, uh, Billy brought this topic up, so... Blame him. <laughs> <laughs> oh gee, thanks! Just back the bus rod over me, why don't you? <laughs> no, we're going to talk uh, memorable theme songs. Those are stuck in your head forever and never destined to leave. (laughs) (laughs) And uh, we're just going to look at uh, TV shows, cartoons. Mm -hmm. I was going to suggest anime, but that might be its own can of worms, Mm -hmm. and we'll just do that. Also, it excludes Billy. Yes. (laughs) Freak. 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 (laughs) (laughs) Well, this is literally the definition of if, two, if the more people are insane, the insane are the norm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so yeah, these theme songs. Um, they're catchy, they're memorable, and usually it's mostly describe the show. Uh, Eddie, you want to talk right off the bat, Billy, because this was your yeah. topic. Well, so like modern shows. Yeah. That have like the themes, uh, I sold. Um, the themes for uh, Sons of Anarchy and Rescue Me. I, I, I haven't had to watch the series. Yeah. And I won't skip the intros. No, because they're just that good. Yeah. Same, another show that was like that now was uh, Shameless. Okay. Because the, the intro for that show is all the you know, family like doing different things in the bathroom, and like says so like the fathers like pass up the floor and they're just moving it out. Yeah. And someone's having sex or someone's like doing other stuff. Okay. <laughs> so for that, it's not the song itself; it's the visual. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the song too like, is like I'm. I'm I can't remember the name of the song. Yeah. But. It was like. Yeah, I. And her name. <laughs> but. Yeah. Uh, Dave, any theme songs that come to your mind when we mention theme song? The 80s. The 80s. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this was the time for theme songs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Be a cartoon or sitcom, <laughs> any f- <laughs> they explain everything in those songs. Oh god, yeah, and made them catchy at the same time. <laughs> Props to the writers for that. Oh yeah. Uh, so what's the premise of this show? Uh, two teenage girls and a dog share an apartment. <laughs> she's a teenage girl and she's with her friend. Dog's also there and it's never the fun never ends. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> I just made that up. <laughs> I should just be a theme song writer. Yeah. yeah. Get this man a recording <laughs> contract. <laughs> <laughs> now, when I heard theme songs, I was just uh, old cartoon. Yeah. Just run for your head. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. From the 80s and 90s. So. Oh, yeah. And mostly Disney cartoons. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Disney are those ones made by Hasbro, I think. Yeah. <laughs> well, for me, at least. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm trying to think here. I was like, Chippendale Rescue Rangers, that's yeah. Disney. Darkwing Duck, that's Disney. Yeah. Tailspin. Tailspin didn't come on to that list until you said it. Mm-hmm. All right. Now it's there. there. DuckTales was there. Yeah, that one was definitely memorable. They reused it for the reboot, so it had to have been yeah. memorable. Gummy Bears? Yeah, now, like, when you mention it, yeah, it's like, yeah, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> We're going through the, the whole Disney afternoon! Yeah, pretty much. Goochoo? Yep. <laughs> what? <laughs> There's one other, but we shall not name it. 
<laughs> Unless you want me to. Go right ahead, bonkers. Yeah? Uh, um. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Those are the main Disney ones, at least. <laughs> oh, wait. There was Pepper Ann. That one had a theme song. <laughs> yeah, which I remember the first time I heard it, it sounded like Dr. Uh, I had something similar to Dr. Jones by Aqua. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're digging up all the old cartoons yeah. now. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But just something about these short little like they were only like one two minutes long sometimes. Yeah. Right? <laughs> sometimes it's just the same thing repeating over and over again, like the Ghostbusters one. Yeah. Or Mega Man. Oh god. <laughs> 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 I completely forgot about that. Super fighting robot. Mega Man. <laughs> <laughs> really earned their paycheck for that one. Five thousand dollars was spent on this beam. <laughs> <laughs> like a thousand dollar word for the five words. Yeah. Super fighting robot mega man. Yeah. <laughs> if you want big mega man two words. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we're talking game songs. How about do the Mario? <laughs> That's an ending theme, though. All right, then the, the intro. <laughs> we'll just wrap some random stuff together. <laughs> oh my God, you're right. They did. <laughs> Everyone remembers the ending to that show, but I always there is an opening to that. Yep. <laughs> Just throw brothers in there a lot, and just <laughs> <laughs> just the characters, and you pretty much get the song. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> like, tell the story of Mario and rap. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the kids like, don't they? <laughs> okay, Phoebe that like as soon as you heard it, you got pumped up and super hyped for the show. Ninja Turtles. The yep. Ninja Turtles, the second you hear that guitar riff. Yeah. <laughs> Power Rangers. It's, correct me if I'm wrong on that. Like, What is the Power Rangers opening theme? Um, go, go, Power Rangers. <laughs> I thought that was just like when they got into fights. No, that was in the intro, too. Yeah. It's it kind of like a guitar riff, too. Yeah. Okay. I it's think. been forever since I've seen Power Rangers. Yeah. I don't remember, but no. I can imagine it'd probably be a hype oh, yeah. opening. Oh yeah, they used the intro during the show too. So yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, no, now it's coming back to me now. <laughs> My nostalgia brain just kicked in. Yeah, so, oh there it is. Remember Rita's like, ah, ten thousand years, you're, she's free. I'm free. It's time to conquer Earth. <laughs> 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 so we need teenagers with attitudes apparently <laughs> why I don't know it's the theme of the show yeah <laughs> <True. laughs> you okay there no alright uh, the X-Men theme yes <laughs> might as well throw the Spider-Man one in there too while we're at it which one the techno or the uh, 80s Techno. Yeah. Since we said X-Men. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the X-Men didn't even need lyrics. Just, just a guitar riff. Yeah. <laughs> it didn't even have to explain anything. They just showed visuals of them, like, flying around, yeah. fighting people in explosions. It was yeah. basically a Michael Bay opening. <laughs> <laughs> Don't explain anything. Just show action. Yeah. <laughs> and then I want a gr big group one-on-one -on -one war at the end. Just yeah. Both sides clack together. 
Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares if they don't? If it doesn't make sense, the kids love that sort of thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna throw an odd one out here: the Donkey Kong Country. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Hey yo! Yeah. Look at that! <laughs> but yeah, no, like for some reason that just clicks in, and you're like, "All right, I feel good for some reason." Yeah. <laughs> Why did they give a banana slammer as a catchphrase? Well, when your main protagonist doesn't even talk <laughs> in his games, um. You're very free roam to what you can he can say yeah, or sing for that matter. Yeah, <laughs> that was the only like thing I didn't care too much about. I don't like musical numbers in my shows, and they always <laughs> had to throw two in. Yeah, mm. you gotta stop everything for a musical number. <laughs> yeah, or we use a musical number to do a transition. Oh God, <laughs> and sandwich. Yeah, no. How can you like not? Say TV show themes without saying the Adams family. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah, as soon as you hear that, you know what's going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hell, it's all these Adams sporting events. Yeah. They, they, like almost every, like a lot of the major sports arenas, like doing like cycle songs through games, would have that played. Oh, okay. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> uh, another odd one Beetlejuice. <laughs> just sing a little and you got it sing la 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 and you got it <laughs> yeah really it's just basically to have that play when you're on a roller coaster yeah <laughs> we'll introduce everything on a roller coaster yeah <laughs> make it out make you make of it what you will yourself yeah <laughs> never get a chance if you can wear a pair of headphones on a roller coaster play that as you're riding the roller coaster. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Especially if it's like one of those haunted theme roller coasters oh, where yeah. you go for the track and <laughs> How could you not? <laughs> exactly. How could you <laughs> I had an opportunity to do that and I went for it. <laughs> oh, so you're speaking from experience. Yes. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you didn't lose your headphones. Uh, no, I, it wasn't that fast of a roller coaster, oh, okay. thank God. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. You know the name lyrics. Are you for the dark? Uh, okay, I was going to get into this because this one was more set the atmosphere. Yeah. yeah. And are you afraid of the dark sets the atmosphere? Yeah. Evil clown. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just in one scene, but it's still there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> those, those shutters. Yeah. Oh, no. Like, like, that head included everything every child was scared of in one opening. Yeah. <laughs> Unintended boats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just lying there. Yeah. <laughs> but it's half the crap, and David, that's what makes it worse. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we all have our phobias. I'm just saying, mine's a little weird. Yeah. <laughs> it's oddly specific. A decrepit boat. <laughs> uh, the other one that set the atmosphere was uh, Batman, the animated series. Oh yeah, so. Didn't say anything, but you knew who he was and what he did. Yeah. Yeah. You, didn't, you little bastards know who I am. I don't need to say anything. Yeah. <laughs> All I have to do is take out two fucks and then stand menacingly on top of a tower on lightning flashes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, come on. Like, that, that. <laughs> this full sense Batman theme. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or the Scooby Doo theme. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm gonna throw ones. Uh, the old Marvel '80s cart or '60s cartoons. Oh yes. 
<laughs> yes, thank whole, you for bringing those up. There's a whole repertoire of these. Yeah. We all know the Spider Man one. Yeah. But Hulk had one, the Fantastic Four. Captain America. America. And his mighty he shield. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it was, was him to them talking about a shield in red, white, and blue. Yeah. <laughs> That's his old gimmick, kids. <laughs> that, that's all he does. <laughs> yeah. Thor had one. Thor had one. Namor had one for some reason. Yeah, it's like, who the hell is Namor? But basically, <laughs> oh. uh, Aquaman. Yeah. Marvel's version of Aquaman. Oh, okay. Hey. I was just saying, like, who? <laughs> yeah. Hey, he was popular one time. <laughs> that one time. <laughs> well, he's still around. He's just... So 65? Yeah. <laughs> He was one of the first Marvel heroes, basically. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's still around, but... I think he's with the X-Men now for some reason or something. I don't know. (laughs) Yeah. The Marvel Universe just gets wacky after a while. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) But yeah, those beams were basically... Give a brief synopsis of the hero that we're portraying. Yeah. The whole episode was weird. <laughs> Did yeah. not set the theme at all. No, it was just Doctor Banner petted by gamma rays turns into the Hulk. There. <laughs> Who is that lovable? What? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah you t- lovable is not something you really put towards the Hulk. Yeah, if actual life of the song. I'm like, yeah. huh? Wait, <laughs> <laughs> hey, time out. What? <laughs> it's it was way too cheery for him. <laughs> yeah. It was such a cheery little tune for the, someone who gets angry and bro- breaks yes. everything. Yep. <laughs> Maybe that's why he's so angry. His theme song sucks. So, we had cartoons, uh, sitcoms. Freeze Company. Huh? Freeze Company. WKRP in Cincinnati. What? (laughs) That's an actual sitcom. Yeah. Okay. Never heard of it, but... (laughs) Well, then I guess we're going to have to teach you about the facts of life. (laughs) Oh, boy. (laughs) (laughs) Um, like the only ones I have are all from TGI Friday. Yeah. Like Two Old Time Family Matters. Yeah. Oh yeah. Full House. Perfect Strangers. Perfect Strangers. <laughs> Was who's the boss ever on TGIF at one time? Um, don't think. No, I think it was on twos. All right. Because I think they even referenced it on Family Guy. All right. Like twos is in the eighties. I was always in bed by it. I hung by love it. Oh! <laughs> Billy, everyone. <laughs> Let's see what Seinfeld counts. Seinfeld had like a little bit yeah. of a one, but not. Yeah, it didn't have lyrics. It was just. Yeah. Oh, no. One. Yeah. I mean, me the children. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Because <laughs> <laughs> just to look that and see the intro where he's handing out money to everyone, then, like, view the dog and take some. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so, I guess we're shifting gears a little bit here, guys, but we're not more talking about, like, the opening instead of just the song. Yeah. All right. So... What opening outside of its song really caught you? Ooh. First one that comes to mind for me is Dilbert's. <laughs> it's like the evolution of man. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the, yeah to, from the sea to the cubicle. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what the hell that 
is. <laughs> yeah. This is where we came from. This is where we ended. Yep. Good job, us. <laughs> <laughs> Loud Howard is glad for that show. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Now, pop quiz question, I don't know, I don't think I have the answer to it, but was Loud Howard actually in the comics? Yes, he just wasn't very used very much for obvious reasons. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, because how do you convey yelling on a comic? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's your answer. Yeah. Yeah. Leave it to Dave. Mm. Yep. I guess theme songs from Rhee are ones that just get to the point. <laughs> yeah. So, like, so ones that kind of sum up the show. And, yeah, like G.I. Joe or Transformers, those were ones that did that. <laughs> I know Transformers, I don't know G.I. Joe. Oh, yeah, now, we're done. now I do. There we go. <laughs> See, it gets in your head. Yeah. <laughs> Like the themes of doing the song, we'll the atmosphere. Yeah. SWAT. Yeah. Okay. Like, just, uh, like, just, it opens with a sign and all that, then, it goes like, okay, I'm trying to get I can help it. <laughs> I just don't yeah. worry about it, but, yeah. Yeah. But, the problem, I think, was, uh, it was a 70s show, then, I think, when they rebooted it, um, uh, my brother said something I was like, yeah, the theme sounds like something out of the seventies. I'm like, uh <laughs> dude, this, this was a remake of a seventies TV show. He's like, oh, like, he's like, oh, I thought it was the remake of the movie. I'm like, <laughs> really? <laughs> like, <laughs> hmm. How about a theme song that made no sense? <laughs> In, I mean, an intro that made no sense. Police Squad. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. At first, it looks like it's a regular police show. Then it throws a bunch of random stuff at you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Does the show have to make sense, or...? <laughs> uh, not really. Okay, the Cowboys of Moo Mesa. <laughs> All right, that one! <laughs> <laughs> Anthropomorphic the cow cowboys fighting crime in the west wild west. It was the weirdest show, man. <laughs> I believe <laughs> it was on like ABC back in the nineties. Because uh. <laughs> cow stand for uh, code of the west. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was real. It happened. Oh man. Do you still remember when ABC made shows out of its bumpers? <laughs> like Bump of the Night and What a Mess. <laughs> yeah. So I'm just like, why? Because <laughs> we can. <laughs> yeah, pretty, apparently. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Bump of the Night got to the point of this show real quick. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, his name is Bumpy, Bumpy, he goes Bumpy the Night. Night. That's all you need to know! Bump, bump, bumpy, bump! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and here's the cast of characters in this crazy show. Here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is like another old show, <laughs> but the themes I know is memorable. Bonanza. <laughs> Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, we are getting a hold of that one. Yeah. Bonanza. No one actually knows the words to Bonanza. <laughs> <laughs> Did they sing it? Or I just There's sing. a few lyrics in there that just no one really catches. Yeah, because yeah, it's hard to. Yeah. <laughs> Me being the TV, the <laughs> awesome TV expert, Dragnet. Yeah. 
Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what you're in for for that. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> hey, another one I just kind of like my court. Oh, the saxophone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> saxophone. <laughs> saxophone. <laughs> Not many people use that anymore. No. Oh. <laughs> That's a shame, actually. Yeah. <laughs> ah, memories. <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just found another theme that just repeats a word over and over again. What? Skeleton warriors. <laughs> of course you'd think that. <laughs> There were other lyrics in there, but yeah, it was pretty much Skeleton Warriors. Yeah. Because they're bad to the bone. Yep. <laughs> That's such a cringy lyric. <laughs> Rab your alley, then. Yep. <laughs> the parts of Darkwater have a theme song I don't remember. I don't remember. There's actually a few shows out there that never had theme songs. Yeah. <laughs> or they were just a really quick opening. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to think here if there's anything else. <laughs> the Calyx and Dinosaurs Count. That was a weird show to start with. But yeah. Yeah. Their theme song didn't help much either. No, it's just, I'll just exploit everything right now yeah. over the song. We don't need a pilot episode. Here's what we do. Yeah. This is your main character. This is what he does. This is his world. Get yeah, watch already. So, I was going to say reboot. Reboot actually does have a theme song. It yeah. just has an opening before the theme yeah. song. Yeah. <laughs> that explains it perfectly. Oh, it explains the world perfectly. For the first two seasons, at least. Yeah. <laughs> then they change it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Season three, they just changed the intro constantly. Yeah. Which was interesting for its time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I only know anime that do that. Yeah. Oh, jeez, I just thought of another Skeleton Warrior like theme song that we didn't catch. Oh. Inspector Gadget. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> to this day, there is no, or at least I don't know about any episode that explains Inspector Gadget. Not, not in detail. No. No. Like, even, like the opening just shows him doing all the goofy stuff and yeah. you're like yeah. why does he have a helicopter in his head why do his arms extend what yeah. the hell is yeah, he that's <laughs> is he a cyborg is he a human is he an android what the fuck's going on <laughs> <laughs> why is the dog doing all the work <laughs> <laughs> Why is the why is his niece and the dog doing everything? Mm-hmm. Where did you get that book? Yep. <laughs> holy no! Holy nuts balls! What computer is in that book? <laughs> yes. How does it work like that? Yeah. It had a laser in it. It had everything. <laughs> 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 All right, let's stop because we start analyzing these. Uh, aspects of Inspector Gadget will be here all night. Yeah. <laughs> and they go crazy doing it. Yeah. That might just be another talk to talk in itself. Yeah. <laughs> How does he work? How do we know? We don't know. <laughs> but we intend to find <laughs> out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to run out of time here for the talk to talk, so we'll do one more final round of last theme you want to mention. Ooh. That'll be. (laughs) 
Yeah, yeah I'm thinking too, so. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Beast Wars had a guitar riff in it. Yeah. <laughs> Since you mentioned reboot. Yeah. <laughs> we have Law and Order. Tales from the Crypt Keeper. Oh, yes. <laughs> Wait, the live action one or the cartoon? The cartoon. I don't know you anymore. What? <laughs> <laughs> I happen to like that show. I know. <laughs> Better than Goosebumps. <laughs> Fight me. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no, because I don't think I can defend it. <laughs> as well as I think I can. <laughs> You're probably right about the goosebumps thing. <laughs> I'll give you that at least. <laughs> and with that, this has been a Starman Talk to Talk. So I'm your host, Devin. Billy, dang it. David, see you later. Have a good one, guys. <laughs>